Hi everyone, welcome back to another Flutter tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to send a push notification in our Flutter app by the use of Firebase. Let's see the demo first. You can see how to send this type of push notification in our Android app by the use of Firebase. You can use the Firebase to send the message notification. After this demo, we start the complete video how to achieve this feature in our Flutter app. Let's start the complete video step by step. This is our brand new Flutter project. I have just set up our Flutter project with Firebase only. Same case for you. You also need to set up your Flutter project. If you don't know how to set up your Flutter project with Firebase, I just create a video for you. You can easily watch this video and after that you can follow with me. According to the latest Flutter object, there is some change in Firebase setup. If you watch this video, you have know that. After that, we have continued. For our convenience, we have followed the official Flutter documentation push notification flutter and firebase after you have searched the official document for cloud messaging you can see this set up firebase cloud messaging in this video we have only done for android first we need to install the app cm plugin we have copied this command from here and paste it in our terminal plugin is easily installed in our system you can see this successfully added now after that we follow the documentation once completed reviewed your application you have just reviewed our application or we restart after that go to the send a text message section here after that access the register token we need the register token we have copy this from here and just paste it below our firebase initialization you just need to and we need to import firebase message after that we print the fcm token print fcm token that's it this is too much easy then the test message now we go our firebase console and we select our firebase connect project we have the messaging already open create our first campaign you can choose any of this i have choose this this is far better we need to enter the title this is our title and this is our subtitle or body the image is optional but we pass the image and paste it here and send the text message when we click this we need the fcm register token we need to paste our fcm token here we have printed our fcm token in our debug console let's open our terminal restart our app after restarting if there is no any fcm token then terminate your app and reinstall you can see this this is our app same token you can copy from here and paste it in our firebase after that click on add section and test we have click on next we have choose the android next now you can schedule as well but right now we have, have sent it at current time and preview you can see this publish go back in your real device this immediately reflect in a simulator it takes some time oh error message in our console unable to log event analytics library is missing now add our analytics library for that flutter pub a firebase analytics after that we restart our project from the terminal view console this is our app shop token now we have add another campaign After we have 
adding firebase analytics we have sent the notification again now minimize our app send we have already aired the fcm fcm registration token test this is our format and we have click on next choose our android device next next and review publish you can see the campaign successfully it takes some time to display the notification message we have wait until it you can see there is the notification message with happy birthday happy birthday my friend and the image we have provided by this way you can easily send the notification by the use of flutter and firebase thanks for watching my video